Sisters Gaming here, and today we're gonna play some Minecraft. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to build a semi automatic wheat farm. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay guys, so we're here in our Minecraft world. This is the wheat farm here. It's a really simple design. We have a collection system here with a chest here for your items. We have the three layers here and the water collection system ready. So as you can see, all of my wheat has grown so now i can flick this lever and it will collect everything i can flick it back everything flows in nicely of course the stuff that i didn't collect doesn't and it will slowly flow in uh, if you don't want to see it you can use an item filter or if you want to speed this process up you can add two hoppers or something and then you can spread the load out like so yeah but it's not required so of course after a collection you take all your wheat seeds and place it back up here and when you're done you just leave it there to grow okay guys so these are the items that you need of course we are not including the wheat seeds and uh, the uh, hoe and this water bucket just indicates that you need water you actually need more okay guys so we're going to start things off with a six by eight um platform of dirt so one two three four five six seven eight across and one two three four five six here now we take our stone stairs place two sideways here uh oops sorry here two sideways like so with one dirt gap on both sides and two facing the direction of the a platform in the middle we take our water bucket and fill this band boy in with some water the same on the other side like so and so this is one of the platforms done or you just now need to replicate that three times over Okay, so when you've done that, like I did here, you can start off up the top here. And take your planks, make a 1x8 platform like this with trapdoors open, like so. Now at the back, you need to make a row of planks like so. Uh, place one over on both sides. Fill every block with the trapdoor with water, like so. And now put some planks on top of the, the water here, like so. Now you need to extend sideways and both sides, like so. And keep one block over the next layer so no items escape, like so. Okay, now at the bottom here, you just need to leave a 1x8 gap here, make a 1x8 row of planks and put some planks on the side. Our last water bucket placed here. Oh, I'm sorry, this block, this block should actually be a stair facing downwards like so, because we will have our chest here like so our 
hoppers. I'm gonna use two here. And we take our signs, place two here on these blocks like so. Then one facing out of both of them. So you have like an L shape if you look from the top. And one more, oops, like so. And I think one last one, yes. So you should have a one here and one here and four sticking out of both of them now we can work with the redstone so we make a line but first we take our lever go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen repeat and like so now if we turn off the lever water will slow down beautifully like so and just imagine we collect it here right back into the chest and if we flick the lever again the water will disappear so of course now what you would do is change everything here into farmland uh, it's gonna be fertilized thanks to the water on the side here and thanks to the fact that these are stairs, nothing leaks out here. So guys, I really do hope that you enjoyed this video. It was a ton of fun to make. And I hope this simple wheat farm will suit your food needs. So guys, I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.